studio, or actually in my garage, because my van is parked there. Uh, that's keeping me warm today because it's about 14 degrees outside, windy, and it's uh, really cold. I mean, that wind is making the, uh, well, the wind chill, I think, is about 5 degrees or less. So it's uh, pretty cold out there. But at least it's warm in the studio, and I'm going to get back to work on my clay. Time to play with some clay. Alright, I've taken the horse off its base and now I can work on it uh, in the round uh, at some point, but I'm going to do basically what I did with the last horse. Um, work on it uh, in a kind of a jury rigged form because I'm not going to be mounting these horses onto uh, armatures uh, to hold them steady. Uh, I've got a different idea, and I'll show you that when I get to that point, which is going to be after I get the next horse, or the last horse, or maybe the next to the last horse uh, done. So I'm going to turn off the camera now and get this thing all set up for uh, working on this horse. A friend of mine uh, from the Midwest uh, sent me a couple items I've as a gift. Um... This is a, a dream catcher she sent me. And I just really love this dream catcher. And by the way, that's the name of my studio. She also sent me this robe that I can put across my lap to keep my legs warm. And let me tell you, down here in the bottom part of the studio, over down near the cement floor, it gets mighty cold, so that, that blanket's gonna come in handy this winter. All right, time for me to get back to work on my clay. Okay, I got my cameras, both of them uh, mounted on my sculpting stand. And I'll show you real quick here how I did that. Took some ingenuity. I've got one sitting here mounted onto this uh, uh, post here. And you can see how I've got that mounted. I, what I did was I got one of these extensions down here that uh, you put the uh, frame or your GoPro on and I put a long screw through the one hole there into this post and that uh, anchors that to that and then I've got a mount that I got uh, from a camera shop and I've got the other camera mounted on that. By the way if you're you're, you're curious about the the rig I've got here set up for my uh, GoPro. It's a it's called a small rig. I think it's called yeah small rig. Um, I think they make them in China. It took me a long time to get them, but actually it didn't take me a long time. But anyway, I don't know. I can't remember. It's been too long. They're really good for mounting your camera if you're constantly moving your camera from a uh, tripod to uh, taking out the uh, memory card and all that stuff. I've got this uh, little flap up here. That's uh, what comes down over the uh, end of the camera and locks in the uh, battery. And uh, I, I leave it up because it makes it easier to pull the camera in and out. But uh, these are very cheap. They're, I think, under 40 bucks, but I can't remember. It's been probably six months, seven months since I bought one. Um, but anyway, it, it has a GoPro mount down here, and it, it folds up just like it does on the camera itself. This is for the uh, uh, Hero 8. I haven't upgraded to the Hero 9, and I probably won't because right now I ain't got the money to do that. <laughs> Alright, I got everything uh, arranged now. I've got the uh, my mannequin of the horse that uh, I bought at a local foundry. Uh, they no longer sell these, so I have no clue where you're going to get them from. This is by, uh, I'll try to read the name here. 
Oh, it's by Jeff Wolf. Uh, he's a local. Well, he's not a local artist. He's a, a sculptor, friend of mine, and uh, he produced these a long time ago. He no longer sells them, but if you do a horse mannequin by Jeff Wolf, you might find a place where you can buy them. They're not cheap. They've gotten more expensive since I bought this one. But uh, anyway, so I'm set up to start start sculpting on this uh, horse. But I'm going to have to do it next week because it took me a couple of hours just to figure out how to set this up so I get the best possible video for you guys. And besides that, I, I'm really not in the mood today to sculpt. It's too darn cold. And I've got to uh, do something about my clay getting a little more warmed up than it is. But it's at least set up now for next week and... Uh, Oh, and, I'm, and on top of all that, my bulb burned down in my uh, over my clay again. It's I, you know these cheap bulbs don't last very long. I use hundred watt bulbs, and uh, you just got to use what you got. Anyway, I'm going to get busy on this uh, Monday, and I'll see you all then. Have a great rest of the weekend. Give me a thumbs up and share my video, and then check out my instructional dvds uh the link down below this video all right see you next time